You better love yourself. You better love. You better, you better love yourself. You better love. You better love yourself. You better love. Hi guys, it's Siobhan. Welcome to this week's vlog. <laughs> so it is Sunday and it is I don't even know what time it is. Where is my watch at? Oh my gosh. So it is four o'clock. <laughs> um, yeah, so it's Sunday. I just finished a video or recording a video to show you guys how to make these waves for my clip in. So make sure you guys watch it. And I finally am about to eat my first meal of today. I don't know why it took me so long, but I went to this vegan spot. Um, and I know with like the virus and everything, um, everyone's being really cautious about going out and stuff. So I ended up getting the food curbside delivered. Um, so the restaurant near me, they it's either you get it from Grubhub or you get it curbside. And I decided to get it curbside because, I don't know, I just feel like it'll go from the people who cooked it to my hands. So just less risk of, I don't know, just going into different people's hands. So yeah. So I'm trying to get some good lighting. I hope this is good. Cute. So yeah, so let me show you guys the food though. So it is a vegan restaurant. <laughs> oh, it's good lighting in here. So it's a vegan restaurant. Um, so no meat, no dairy, but it is so good. So I, I got this um, sandwich that's called like the sweet and sassy. It's literally this sauce over this tofu. Who would have thought like I would be eating a freaking tofu sandwich? But let me show you guys. And I just got like some lettuce on the side that made me feel healthy. But yeah, it's freaking tofu with avocado and onions, but the tofu is so good. They're also known for their um, milkshake. So they use almond milk, I believe, or, or soy base. Mm, it's so good. This is the butter um, butternut one. No, no, no. Um, Butterfinger. Yeah, it's so good. Yeah, so, you know, it's Sunday, just starting the week. Um, let me fit you guys up there. Okay, so, you know, tomorrow I have work. So today I'm just relaxing. Um, I try not to look at emails on the weekend because I try to like relax but the emails are piling up because of what's going on and everything in healthcare so I am in the medical field so I just want to be alert of whatever is going on you know so I'll check some emails um other than that I'm just gonna relax and I'll take these clip outs I don't want to though they look so cute oh my gosh so cute Hey guys, good morning. It is 8 a.m. and I'm getting ready for work. <laughs> um, so I just wanted to show you guys my morning um, skincare routine. So I wash my face and I just got out of the shower and I got dressed because um, I didn't want to get on my camera naked. <laughs> so um, I didn't moisturize my face yet because I wanted to show you guys what I do. So the first thing I take is my Mered and Central C, um, Essential C Eye Cream. So here it is. And this is to help with my under eye, under eye beds because I get tired and the um, dark marks I have. And so I literally just take this half size of a pea and just dot it under my eyes. And then I just dab it with my pinky 
making sure that I don't rub it in because rubbing creates more wrinkles. The next thing I do is take the Murad Hydro Dynamic Ultimate Moisture Cream. So in the purple container and put that all over my face because I do have um, dry skin. So I wanna make sure I use items that moisturize my skin. And I love the Murad product. So Dr. Murad is a pharmacist, um, his pharmacist trained and a dermatologist. So he's like the best of both worlds. So I love his products. And I'm literally almost down to the end. So I have to order some more. I really need to go to the mall, but it's quarantine. We're quarantined, so I can't go to the mall. So I'm gonna order from Sephora online. Then to seal everything in, I use the Josie Moran 100% um, argan oil. And I just take a couple drops and put it all over my face. So I am getting ready um, for work. So I am working from home. So I am in um, the healthcare field and I do primary care. So adult medicine and I'm fortunate to not, enough to do, um, be able to do telemedicine, which is basically um, an appointment with your provider, but it's virtual. So it's really nice. That way you don't have to go outside um, and risk being exposed to coronavirus. And I'm just using Burt's Beads um, chapstick. I love their chapstick. And then I go over it with their hydrating lip oil. So here, it's the almond oil and this keeps my lips moisturized. Um, so yeah, so I'm gonna do telemedicine and I'm also an educator, so I'll be meeting with students via Zoom. And we'll just go over a couple of um, cases and th therapeutic um, plans. So for my hair, I just have two um, braids. Um, and the good thing about going telemedicine and zooming, like when you are seen on a camera, it doesn't really show details of your hair. So my edges are not done and I'm probably not going to do them. So what I've been doing to help um, keep my hair moisturized during this time. So the winter has been so dry and it has not only affected my skin like my face, but it also has affected my scalp. So what I have been doing is I wash my hair and then I grease my scalp with sulfury. So you guys know what sulfur weight is. So here's right here. And it's definitely helped get rid of the, um, the dry skin and my scalp. And then the next thing I do is I moisturize my, <clears throat> I moisturize my um, hair with this argan oil from Holistics. My um, hairstylist sells it and she recommends it, so I love it because it's a lightweight oil and it doesn't leave me greasy. So this is my outfit. I have on the shirt that I typically will wear to work and then I have on black leggings. So I typically would not wear these leggings to work, but people will only be able to see me from hair up so I don't have to worry about my bottoms. But these are my favorite leggings, guys. I love these leggings. They I got these from Soma. They go all the way up the waist and they basically snatch your waist in. And they're very flatter, flattering on your body. And then even then like the bum area, they give your bum like a little boost. So I love them so much. They were a bit pricey. They were like $50, but I splurge on it because they make your, they flatter my body really, really good. So I love them. So yeah, this is my, my outfit. 
don't have any shoes on <laughs> put some house slippers so yeah i'm going to go to work right now in my living room and i'll chat with you guys later i hope you have a great day pepper cod which is fish <laughs> if you don't know what cod is and so for my salad I'm just gonna put a little ranch dressing dressing on there and then I'm also going to have a boiled egg just to make sure I'm full so I'm trying to eat a low carb diet to help maintain my weight during quarantine so if this doesn't fill me up then I'll just have the boiled egg on the side but yeah that's my dinner it's sunday we made it through another week of quarantine yay so today is also easter so happy easter if you celebrate easter uh today i am getting ready to go nowhere <laughs> i just wanted to feel cute so i did my makeup nothing crazy and i'm going to do my hair so i want to have some flips so my hair kind of naturally flips up a little bit at my shoulders because of the length it is, but I'm gonna curl it so I can go up like this. It's crazy. So I've been seeing, you know, little posts on Instagram when people are like, um, during this time of quarantine, you should be like forming another line of income or creating another business or picking up another skill. And it's just like, you can assume that people are having a bunch of free time during this time because I'm not, you know, I'm still going to work. Um, and there are, I'm sure there are other people who are still going to work or they're able to stay at home, but they have to turn into a school teacher because they're teaching their children while at home. And, you know, you can't just assume that everyone's at home doing nothing. So you can't just try to pressure people to say like, oh, you need to pick up another skill or start a YouTube channel or make some more money. Like, no, people are literally dying around us. So if you cannot focus on making another line of income, do not feel pressure, you know? Just try to stay sane during this time because this is this is a crazy time, so
for this week. I hope you guys have a great week this week, another week of quarantine, <laughs> but stay sane. Although we're alone, we're alone together. <laughs> That's the hashtag everyone's using. So yeah, you know, just um, keep pressing, pressing for. And if there's any other videos that you would like me to do regarding like hairstyles, um, leave a comment below. So like, comment, and subscribe. I probably should have said that at the beginning, but I don't know. But yeah, like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> Bye guys.